Hey, what's up, YouTube? Talking through a respirator right now. Definitely want to wear one of these when you're mixing up store-bought refractory or any kind of dusty material. So I just opened up the bag here. I want to show you, if you've never seen it, what a professional refractory looks like. By the way, always wear gloves. Do as I say, not as I do. Um, you can see large chunks in here. Very fine powder. Uh, this stuff is ladle cast. It's by Chicago Firebrick. Um, the large chunks, I want to say, are chunks of expanded alumina, but I could be wrong. Um, alumina is one of the primary ingredients in most professional refractories because it's got a very high melting temperature, somewhere in the neighborhood of about 3,800 degrees Fahrenheit, I believe. Don't quote me on that. So I'm going to dump this bag into this bucket. We're going to mix it up, start lining the inside of the furnace here, and I'll take some pictures as I go. For this video, I'm going to be skipping the steel wires. Um, I don't think they're going to be necessary. Now, if I was using a homemade refractory, I would be using the steel wires. But since this stuff is from a well-known brand, it's a high-quality refractory, I don't feel the wires are necessary. So on with the respirator and let's start making this thing. <laughs> 